So initially, we had quite a bit of resistance because we actually had two previous data catalog before moving to Atlan. So a lot of the initial thought is, okay, here we go with another data catalog, which I might never use. But one of the things that we've done during our POC was to engage with different personas across different data domains team, right? To really understand the use cases, the pain points in order to bring that into the POC. Uh, and this started to excite quite a lot of, of people, right? And that facilitates a lot of the choice for us to go with Atlan compared to, for example, other data catalog where we've done also a POC for. So really, I would say really understanding the different pain points of the different personas, because a data engineer will have different problems than, you know, from what the business is looking for. So it, it took, I would say it was a challenge in, initially, but the amount of like presentations that we went through, the different engagement team that we brought in into the POC really got team excited. And we used to get quite a lot of uh, Slack messages saying, when can I use Atlan? Or some people were already seeing the value of Atlan during the POC itself. And this is where we started seeing a different culture shift. And, and one of the good thing is people started to realize that not only data management and data governance, but this was the right thing to do when it comes to managing the life cycle of data, right? So the people started seeing our team as, you know, enablers rather than, okay, here we go with the data governance team. And, and this was the shift.